Welcome back to Tashkid FX for another price prediction update and in this video I'll be giving you a price prediction update on Gala Games whose current price stands at the 0 0.023 2732 dollar mark and here on trading view the market is down by 0.76 percent and in this video i want to give you the key scenarios that i expect to play out basing my analysis on the edu 12 structures the fibonacci's and also the key areas of, su of support and resistances and also draw out any key chart patterns that you have information on this chart and i'll kickstart the video by giving a brief of what has been happening on this chart gala games from these low prices that we had been trading within we saw a very nice impulsive movement taking us to an all time high in what I'm terming as an ADU12 structure to the upper side as an ADU12 count one. Then we have seen an ABC corrective movement which has now taken us back to around the 0.02 dollar mark in what I'm in what I'm terming as a higher ADU12 count two. And after seeing that low at around the 0.02 dollar mark, I believe it has done the minimum that we expected that ABC corrective movement to do. And we might have seen the low for that higher ADU12 count two. And there's a possibility of seeing a reversal to the upper side in the formation of a higher edu 12 count 3 before we see a, a, a bit of a retracement in the formation of our way 4 and then continue pushing higher in the formation of our way 5 also taking us back to an all time high and that will happen in the next bull market and from here on the daily chart I can sketch out a minimum target area to the upper side in the formation of this higher edu 12 count 3 using the Fibonacci that is the trend based Fibonacci connecting it from the low of this wave 1 to the high of that wave 1 then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave and that gives me a minimum target area to the upper side at the fib level 1.618 and that perfectly lies at around the 1.33 1.366 dollar mark and that is my minimum target area to the upper side in the formation of that higher edu 12 count 3 and that will happen in the next bull market and once we see a reversal here on the gala games chart jumping to the one hour chart for further analysis before we saw our low here on the Gala Games chart, we had lost a key area of support over here at around the 0.04 dollar mark and we saw that impulsive movement to the lower side making our low and after making that low we have been seeing a bit of a bounce to the upper side in a movement that I believe has been obeying the edu 12 structures also and because we are in the formation of a higher edu 12 count 3, uh, we expect impulsive movement, uh, uh, wave 3 is an impulsive movement and because of that we expect fractal waves in formation within that higher edu 12 count 3 to the upper side and I believe we, are start, we have started seeing such a structure over here having these as the higher as the wave 1 to the upper side then we have seen this retracement over here which I'm terming as a wave 2 then I expect a wave 3 then a wave 4 before we continue pushing higher in a wave 5 to complete a higher edge 12 count 1 which is a fractal wave within that higher edu 12 count 3 to the upper side and getting a little bit into the details of the formation of this edu 12 structure over here after making our high for that first wave we have been seeing this retracement in the formation of our wave 2 and using the Fibonacci's connecting them from the low of that first wave to the high of the wave 1 we can sketch out a minimum retracement area in the formation of this wave 2 over here between the Fib level 0 0.5 and the Fib level 0 0.618 and I can mark that target area here on the charts and you can see we have managed to fully maximize that target area and because of that I'm extending my uh, target area back to the FIB level 0 0.78 which perfectly lies at around the 0 0.026 dollar mark and there's a possibility that uh, we have fully maximized that target area to the FIB level 0 0.78 FIB level and very soon I'm expecting a reversal here on the Gala Games chart and in that movement I'm expecting a very nice impulsive movement to the upper side in the formation of this wave 3 to the upper side and using the trend based Fibonacci I can sketch out a mini minimum target area to the upper side using the trend based Fibonacci connecting it from the low of that first wave to the high of the wave 1 then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave and that gives me a minimum target area to the upper side in the formation of this wave 3 at the fib level 1.618 which perfectly lies at around the 0 0.0463 dollar mark and that is the minimum that I'm expecting that impulsive movement to the upper side to do in the formation of this wave 3 so there is a possibility that once we see a reversal here on the games chart there is a possibility of trading back to around the 0 0.04 dollar mark and for that to also happen i expect to see uh uh, Gala Games managed to break above the 20 day MA here on the one hour chart which is now acting as resistance also on the indicators here on the one hour chart 
on the one hour RSI we are trading at around the 41 mark meaning we have massive room for us to support any movements to the upper side so that movement to the upper side in the formation of that with three on the RSI will still be supported also taking a look at the MACD on the MACD we have also printed uh uh, we have printed a bearish cross and we are seeing a bit of an increase in the selling momentum and that would mean maybe lower prices are coming our way so the reversal is not happening soon we might expect a bit of lower prices bef before we see that reversal to the upper side in the formation of that with three to the upper side and that's the update for gala games